Hi, this is Shannon from MilkandCuddles.com. This is a video that goes along with a post, which I'll link in the comments, about Great Wolf Lodge's Magic Quest. One of the first things you want to know is that the object you're looking sometimes is in the ceiling. It's not always going to be something on the wall or in the hallway that you're in. Another important thing to know is that when you've accepted a quest, you need to be sure you've pushed the accept button on the screen. Otherwise, your wand may not be recording all of the things you find after that. Thirdly, you'll want to really listen when something you activate is talking to you. A lot of times they're giving you a clue about the next place you're supposed to go or the order in which you need to get things. Go away. You can't help me. It is time for celebration. Yay! There's some really cute um, little things that activate and play music. And... There's even paintings that come to life, so keep your eye open for those. Sometimes you may find that your wand doesn't seem to be working, and one of the tips about that is really to um, kind of give it one shake and point it at the object that you want to activate. If it doesn't seem to be working, usually there's a little symbol somewhere on um, either the statue or the painting um, that has a little magic quest symbol on it, that is usually where your wand needs to be pointing. Sometimes it even helps to touch your wand to that little symbol. There's a lot of walking in magic quest, so wear comfortable shoes. Also, you're going to want to try to use the stairwell more than you use the elevator. The reason is that there are actually clues in the stairwell that you won't be able to find if you're only using the elevator. You'll know what floor you're on because they're all labeled really well. Also, when you get out into the hallway, you can find different little artifacts in that f middle part of the hallway, but as soon as you've walked so far that you're around rooms, you should know that you won't find any more artifacts. They only put them in the public areas, not where people are sleeping. Um, there's also a really cool room in the Grapevine location that has a little pixie in it. And it also has trees where you can accept new quests or just check and see on your progress. There's also a phone in this room that will actually tell you um, clues if you call the number. My daughter really liked the pixie in this. And the pixie will actually give you some information as well. This powerful enchantment will be a great help to you throughout the kingdom. Use it wisely and good luck. Magic Quest really um, has some neat little rhymes, some great character traits that you're searching for, cooperation, bravery, um, and it's definitely one of the things that we enjoy the most about Great Wolf Lodge and we'll keep coming back for. So I hope this helps you give you an idea of what Magic Quest involves. Thanks.